Hey, this is Jerry Work with Profit Dig, and today I want to show you a really cool feature that will reduce the time it takes you to start using the Profit Dig system. Because as you know, Profit Dig is a job bidding and costing solution, but before you can start bidding jobs, you have to set up the information in the system, uh, your equipment, your employees, and your bid items so that you can start bidding jobs. So if you are in the excavation field, this will really save you a lot of time because it will actually create many of the bid items that you need to bid jobs for you. And if you're in a different type of field, it will give you a really good demonstration of what your bid item, items should look like. So I am on the main dashboard. This is a brand new account that I just created. It doesn't have anything set up yet but I'm going to click this add demo data button A little message here it's going to demonstrate uh, generate some test data etc okay okay so now we have a demo project so let's click that and see what that looks like but if we look at this demo bid Okay, it created a very simple starting bid that has two bid items in it. So you will recall we did not set any of this stuff up. It, it's done for us automatically. So if I come over here and I look at my bid items and headers, here is a starting set of uh, headers that contain a starting set of bid items for each of those headers so again if you're in excavation you know these are many of the things you will typically be including in your bids so this has saved uh, a lot of time and if you're not in excavation again the point is to give you a really good demonstration of what a set of bid items and headers look like so you know if you're in a different field your information here will be different, but it will still be a numbered system that contains the units of work that go into your, your job bids. Okay, so if we have bid items and headers, then we must also have employees and equipment because those are the things that make up what goes into your bid items. So sure enough, here are four employees. And so this is just made up fake kind of data, but you can see, um, you know, what these guys look like. So you could actually go in here and edit these if you wanted to, to keep these, or you can just delete all of these and go in and add your own employees. But so here's just a starter kit of make believe employees. And here's the same for equipment. Here's kind of a starting set of equipment you know it's very possible you may have some of this same equipment or yours may be completely different so again you can edit these guys or you can add your own equipment and delete this made up stuff however you want to do it but the point is we have uh, demonstrated to you what this stuff looks like in the profit dig system and so you know you could take all this and and start bidding jobs with it or you can delete all of this and, and add your own stuff and start from scratch. However you want to do it, uh, using the demo data button to publish all this stuff to the system can save you a good bit of time either in setting up bids or in learning how to use ProfitDig. So that's all we're going to do today. Check us out online at ProfitDig.com if you need any help. Thanks.